The KuCam Ego is a unique 3D camera that aims to redefine the way we capture and experience moments. With its dual lens setup and innovative features, it offers users the opportunity to explore the world of 3D photography and videography. And while it has some noteworthy qualities, there are a few aspects that could be improved upon. One of the key highlights of the KuCam Ego is its ability to capture 3D content. By utilizing the dual lens system, the camera allows users to create immersive and lifelike images and videos. This feature opens up new creative possibilities, especially for those interested in experimenting with 3D content. Whether you're looking to capture stunning landscapes or unique perspectives, the KuCam Ego provides an avenue for innovative expression. This camera is designed for content creation with things like VR in mind, like Apple Vision Pro, or the multitude of VR headsets available for use with your smartphone. Luckily, the KuCam Ego also includes a snap-on viewer, so you can quickly preview your shots and recordings on the go, which gives the added benefit of triggering my Viewmaster nostalgia. Also included is a small mirror to snap on the front of the camera to make sure you're in frame for selfie or vlogging shots. However, it's important to clarify that the KuCam Ego does not fall into the 360 degree camera category. It focuses specifically on 3D content creation rather than capturing a full spherical view. This distinction is crucial for potential buyers to understand before making a purchase decision. In terms of image quality, the KuCam Ego shoots in superb dual 1080p resolution and should be noted that it's not 4K. Nonetheless, the camera's image quality remains decent, providing sharp and detailed visuals in well-lit environments. When we look at how the images are pulled together to create a final 3D image, we can see that different parts of the image are in focus and we're getting a different perspective on each image. So it's really interesting to check out how it tricks your brain if you're into that sort of thing. One area where the KuCam Ego falls short is its battery life. The camera's battery drains quickly, which can be frustrating when you're in the middle of a creative session or on an extended shooting day. It's advisable to invest in some spare batteries if you plan on doing extended shoots or bring along an external power bank to ensure uninterrupted usage. I personally use this power handle from Ulanzi, however keep in mind that if you power this camera with an external power bank, you will need to keep the battery door open because the charging port is housed within. This is by design to keep the unit weatherproofed. The KuCam Ego's user interface and controls are relatively straightforward, making it accessible to both beginners and experienced photographers. The companion app offers convenient connectivity to your smartphone, enabling you to preview and manage your content on the go. However, you should be aware that the app is not compatible with every phone. It didn't work with my Galaxy A13, but luckily I had an old Galaxy A9 that I was able to use with the camera. Also of note, KuCam offers free desktop software that can be used to edit your footage, and it's pretty straightforward and intuitive to use. This is a vlogging slash selfie slash microphone test of the QCam Ego. I am in uh, manual focus mode right now and I've got the camera on a selfie stick about an arm's distance and a half away, if that makes any sense. This is also a microphone test, mic check one, two, three, mic check one, two, three, four. It's a somewhat breezy day. Got a little bit of a wind kicking up right now. Mic check one, two, three, mic check one, two, three, four. While the KuCam Ego has its limitations, it does offer a unique proposition for individuals interested in 3D photography and videography. Its 3D capabilities and compact design make it a viable option for those looking to explore this niche field. In summary, the KuCam Ego is an intriguing 3D camera that opens up new possibilities for creative expression. Its dual lens system allows for immersive 3D content creation, but it's important to note that this is not a 360 degree camera. The camera's image quality is impressive, but should be noted that it's dual 1080 and not 4K resolution. The battery life is a drawback requiring careful management or the use of extra batteries or external power. If you have a specific interest in 3D content and can accommodate its limitations, the KuCam Ego can be a valuable tool for your artistic endeavors. So this is a really cool product. This is really well made and it's uh, something that if you're looking to create content for like the new Apple Vision Pro, this would be a really cool thing to have. 
It's also a very niche product, and I personally am never going to create any kind of 3D stereoscopic video. It's just not my thing. That being said, I don't want to see this go to waste. I don't want this to just sit in a corner and collect dust. So I want to do a giveaway on this product, and uh, this is kind of a test run for more future giveaways on this channel. And uh, I've not done any other giveaways, not for a very long time. The first one that I tried to do was an absolute disaster. So I'm going to try it again with a little more knowledge this time around, but there's going to be a link down below where you can go and register to win this. Um, in the past, I have given a lot of tech that sits around and collects dust to friends, and I've donated things like that to schools and whatever. I think it's time for me to start giving this kind of stuff to my viewers, so uh, my way of giving back to you guys for spending your time watching this channel. Anyway, as I mentioned, there is going to be a link in the description where you can register to win this. Um, some quick and dirty rules here. You do need to be 18 or older to enter, and you need to live in the United States. I just don't want to deal with international shipping. So check out the link below for details. I'm going to pick a winner at random, and I'll send this to you. And uh, hopefully somebody gets some good use out of this. I did not have the foresight to keep the box that it came in because I didn't really plan on giving this away until kind of a last minute. It does come in the carrying case, and I've got the uh, cable and the uh, wrist strap in here that comes along with it. And I will pack it nicely as I send it out, so you'll be getting a nice product. Anyway, if you want to win this, I wish you the best of luck. And uh, like I said, there's going to be a link in the description. Check it out. All the details are there. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Good luck.